Well, I'm definitely glad that I did not go for the upset special today. <laughs> All right. Um, because the Giants, yeah, they got their butts kicked today. I mean, in order for the Giants to win this game, the Giants would have had to have played a perfect game in order for this to even be a close game. I say that thinking about the Giants. There were certain situations. There was, um, who was it? Was it Leonard Williams, the, the defensive lineman? He sacked Brock Purdy, and they called uh, roughing the passer on that play. That is a big momentum killer if you're the New York when you're the New York Giants in that situation, because you're like, all right, man, we got the quarterback. We got the quarterback. We could build some momentum. Bam. Bam. Got flagged for the penalty. Then there was another play where, was it Keon Thibodeau? Pass interference. And it was an obvious pass interference, but it's like, man, like, you could have held the Niners to a field goal right there. And then maybe, who knows, if you're the Giants, you come down, you get a touchdown, make this game more competitive. But, you know, it's one of those things. I mean, every team is going to get, get have penalties called on them, and the Giants would have have to have played the perfect game. Um, Christian McCaffrey, I thought he was going to give me four touchdowns, but he only gave me one. But I did get 20 fantasy points with that, so that's cool. That's cool. As a Seahawks fan, man, this stings. is really stings because – you don't want to watch the Niners win. You don't want to watch them win. I mean, the thing about it is, I when it was like five minutes left in the game, I had to turn the game off because I don't want to see them celebrating their win. I already know they won, so why should I sit and celebrate and watch them win as a Seahawks fan? Why would I do that? But, you know, um, the Giants, they had... Uh, yeah, Brock Purdy has had a nice game. Let me see. Brock Purdy... What, 310 yards, two touchdowns, Q, a, a rating of 111.3? Oh, my goodness, man. Like, I don't know. Brock Purdy, he's just, he's not doing anything fancy. He's just giving you the basics, Matt, you know, giving you the basic fundamentals. And there's nothing wrong with that. I believe in fundamentals. There's nothing wrong with doing the basic fundamentals. You know, we live in a society where people treat the word basic as if it's below normal. OK, no, basic is not below normal. Basic is better than below normal. Basic is average. All right. It's nothing. Wrong. Sometimes there's nothing wrong with average. You can't be great at everything. So if you can be average at most things, nothing's wrong with that. It's better than be to be average and basic than below that. Because Brock Purdy, his game, there's nothing fancy about his game. It's basic. And. Right now, he, he's a top 10 quarterback. Brock Purdy is a top 10 quarterback right now, people. Trust me, I don't want to admit that. He's a top 10 quarterback. There's a lot of quarterbacks that are not top 10. Not a lot of quarterbacks that if they were to play basic, oh, man, their teams would win more ball games. I mean, he's not turning the ball over. That's basic, not turning the ball over. Moving the ball to the downfield, not turning it over. That's basic, okay. Shit, sign me up for basic, all right? <laughs> Anyways, yeah, good shout-out to the San Francisco 49ers. They secured the victory. All right, Giants, yeah, I don't know what y'all going to do. But, um, yeah, I have Daniel Jones on my fantasy team, too. No, I did not start him. I did not even think about starting th I didn't even think about starting him. I knew I wasn't going to start him in this game. Should have started him last week, but I knew I wasn't going to start him against the Niners. I just knew that. But anyway, share your thoughts in the comment section below and let me know, hey, what were your thoughts about the 49ers victory over the Giants? Did you hate it or love it or you just don't even care, all right, because it's not your team? If you're a Niners fan, I already know you care. I already know you care. If you're a Giants fan, I already know you care. But share your thoughts. I want to hear them. Please hit that like and subscribe button. Student of the Game podcast. Peace out.